shake it for me, girl. Shake All right. It for me. What do you get when the coffee pot stops brewing, the leaf blower stops blowing, or the laptop goes haywire? You get a big problem, huh? Do you fix it or do you go buy a new one? Well, Angie's List recently reviewed records over the past decade to see if the repair industry itself is in need of repair. The answer might surprise you in this report from our Valley View Live sponsor, Angie's List. It's easy to toss the toaster that keeps burning your toast. It's a convenient excuse to upgrade. Buying disposable products actually dates back to the 1950s. But did we really become a throwaway society with no room for repair? You might be surprised to find out the repair industry is doing just fine. Across the 30 categories related to repair over the last 10 years, they're holding steady or even growing. U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics backed this up, showing virtually no change in employment with the repair industry. And Angie's List records indicate a steady stream of repair jobs for things like gas grills and musical instruments. Repairs for screens, large appliances, and furniture have dropped only slightly. There are a couple of items that people tend to replace rather than repair, and they include VCR and watches. You know, let's face it, VCRs are becoming more outdated, even though I still have one myself. Watches still get repaired periodically, but not as much as they did 10 years ago. When it comes to electronics and appliances, Angie's List recommends using its cost plus age formula to determine whether to replace or repair. Replace any item if the repair will cost more than half the price of buying a new one and if it's nearing the end of its useful life. Apply similar logic to expensive clothing and jewelry. If the consumer made an initial investment in that that was pretty large, you know, I'm saying a refrigerator and they can get it fixed for a couple hundred dollars, they may opt to repair. Worried you can't find a repair man or woman? Don't be. Employment experts in Angie's List show there are plenty of them out there still going strong. Alrighty, when it comes to vacuums, Angie cautions people about tossing out the old one too quickly. Company research shows a decline in these repairs, but she says a number of members report repairs costing as little as $5 made their 10 to 20 year old machines as good as new. Angie's List is a proud sponsor of Valley View Live. So if one of your appliances breaks, Todd, do you mm -hmm. fix it? Do you throw it away and say, you know what, I'm just going to buy a new one? Uh, when it comes to vacuum cleaners, I'll give you a tip. And this comes from a Ooh, nine year old please. boy who calls my show. Uh, on the coyote, oh, and he, he went on for five minutes about vacuum cleaners. The one little after. boy. He's nine years old. His name is, name is Anthony. Anthony, and he said, "You need to clean your filter and your vacuum cleaner, you know." And that's do you does your vacuum have poor suction? And I'm like, <laughs> really? Is he a repairman on you the side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. know so much about vacuum cleaners. So check your filter. That might be the only thing you might need to just replace the filter instead right. of the whole thing. We were talking about that today. That sometimes, I mean, I know in my generation. We aren't necessarily calling the repairman. I mean, there's probably an app for that, or there's something that's a little bit more convenient than taking it to a repairman. But mm -hmm. vacuum cleaners is a good one because I'm not going to get down. It smells when you flip it over and the it starts. Dust. When something dust. breaks, Gross. I think it's a great opportunity to buy something new. So I always buy something new. Thank you. Yeah. If you have a coupon. No, I don't need a coupon. You don't need a coupon. But mm. it's just a great time to replace, to upgrade. I'm like, okay, if I had that for a long time, yeah. it's time to get something different. Now and I have to ask, what if I, everything breaks at the same it time? It doesn't. Just throw it out. <laughs> it's your karma. And get a new life. You need a new life. Ooh, all right. Okay. <laughs> I hope my vacuum breaks. Yeah. Come on, do it. Up next on Valley.